Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Chaos and Order, art by Susan Holt. That's me. Uh, tonight is September 28th, 2022. Welcome to Zen Stay Wednesday Live. So tonight, uh, I am super excited because uh, it is time to call first dibs on the monthly painting. And I'm also having a studio clearance sale, so I've got some of those items to show you. Uh, looks like Chris is watching. Hey, Chris, can you type a comment so I can see if it pops up, please? Chris is my hubby, so he will be uh, seeing if I can, can see his comment. Uh, for those of you who are live with me, thank you so much for watching. Oh, perfect. Thank you. So I can um, see the comments tonight, which is great, and you guys can hear me. Chris just confirmed that. So for those of you who are watching live, thank you. Uh, I see Errol is here. Hello, hello. Uh, for those of you who are watching in replay, thank you for watching. If you do watch in replay, go ahead and put hashtag replay in the comments for me. That way I know you stopped by. Uh, if you have a question, go ahead and give me a little bit of context because sometimes Facebook doesn't give me the questions at the same time in the video <laughs> that they post, so I don't know what you're talking about. And I want to give you the correct information, so that would be really helpful. Oh, I see Peggy is here. Hi, Peggy. Give that hubby a big hug for me. Um, I do go back and rewatch all of the videos in replay. So I do watch them back. I do comment. Uh, when I say something you guys like, give me some thumbs up. If I say something you guys really love, give me a heart. Give me several. I don't care how many you give me. Just give me some. I love them. They're wonderful. So uh, if you see a piece of art you like, thumbs up. If you see a piece of art you love, give me some hearts. I see Marcy is here. Hi, Marcy. So tonight we have, uh, Peggy says hi to you at work. So all I can do is listen. No worries. I'm just happy to see that you're here. Um, so tonight we are doing first dibs on the monthly painting. So I will show that to you in just a little bit, but I want to show you some of the pieces that are, well, mostly available. I see Megan is here. Hi, Megan. Mostly available for the studio clearance sale that I'm having. I have a lot of uh, older works around my studio that are taking up room, and I would really like to get them the heck out of here and into their new forever homes. Yes, I used to be an adoption counselor at a couple of different pet rescues here locally, so sometimes I talk about my art as needing to get them adopted out into to homes because that is how my brain is wired at this point. Okay, let's get the show on the road. So first I wanted to show you some of the little um, the little paintings that I have that are on clearance right now. And you can look for these um, on my website. And if you would like the web address. It's www.saholtstudios.com. And if you want me to write that in the comments later, I certainly can. But these are little gouache and watercolor paintings. And these are just little jewel paintings. That's what I call them, my little jewel paintings. And they are, everything that's on sale right now is all 50% off. So you see, this one isn't very big. I think this is a with mat, it's four by four, so it's a standard size that can pop in a frame pretty easily. I'm gonna take this one out of the out of the protective wrapper as well. And then this one, this one is eight by ten with the mat. It's a little bit different style, and there's a bunch of different ones that are up on my website. You can also find them up at the top of the group if you're on the computer. Uh, just Scroll to the top of the group when you have a minute and click on the, the little word that says media. It'll open up and if you'll, you will read uh, uh, like three little tabs in that section. If you go to um, albums, all of these are in the albums. 
so you can find everything up there easy peasy. Vita is here. Hi, Vita. Thank you for watching. This next piece is a piece of calligraphy that I did. And all of you know by now that I have a thing for spirals and art and the round and all that kind of good stuff. So this piece has glitter on the back and I have no idea why. <laughs> it's an art studio. There's glitter everywhere. So this I call Dragon. And everything on here, the lettering is all hand-done calligraphy in red ink. And I drew the dragon just from, from my mind. So we'll give you a close-up on that. Get my face out of the picture. And then I used a technique called pointillism. And that is where you just make all sorts of tiny little dots for the shading. I had a lot of fun doing this one. I like this piece a lot. It's one of my faves. And then I've got two more pieces to show you and then we'll get to the monthly painting. And this is one of my prints and I went back through on this one. This is the only one that has this and I put one of my spiralism spirals on there and I made it kind of super fancy. I was doing a little experiment with this piece. So this is a print. This is not an original. Uh, the Sun Bear prints are also prints and not original. They are all limited edition. They are numbered and signed at the bottom and they come with our certificate of authenticity and the whole nine yards. I had these professionally printed a while ago. And a lot of people say, oh yes, I love them, I love them, but I still have a bunch of them and they need to go <laughs> to somebody else's house, please. So if you are interested in any of those, check out the album section, check out my website. And then last but not least, I have uh, Chris says the Sun Bear original is mine. I love it. Yes, the Sun Bear original is his. The um, Sea Turtle original is mine. I have it here in my studio. He has the Sun Bear in his office and they get lots of oohs and ahs all the time. So if you want a, a nature piece that's going to really stun people and kind of have them hold their breath when they come in, that is not super expensive. Prints are a great way to get that effect for um, a bit less money. And right now they're 50% off. So if you're on a budget, it's a great way to get uh, original art or these really nice big prints. Okay, Chris says, prints are gorgeous and high quality. I highly recommend them. Oh, thanks, babe. All right. This is one of my vented hats. This is a painted one. Um, the ones that are in black and brown and gray are felt, but the ones that are in bright colors or white are all um, silk hats, and they actually have plastic in them, so you can kind of position them and move them around. You can dip down the, the brim if you wanted to, to go for a certain look, but these little hats, these big hats, are all one of a kind. They all start out completely white. This is the color of the original color of the hat. And then I throw my art degree at them. So this one is the Monarch Butterfly Hat. This one just sold. That's why I got it out. I have to pack it up, <laughs> get it ready to go to its forever home. So I hand cut all of the leather gaskets, hand pound every rivet. And as you can see, there's wire mesh in there so bugs don't get in your hair. So the theory behind these is the warm air kind of um, escapes the top. Kind of like, um, not evaporative cooling, but I, if you're sweaty, it is totally evaporative cooling. So my husband and I, when we wear these to steampunk events, we go outside for a little bit get overheated because Victorian clothes in the desert southwest of Arizona it's really not a good combination <laughs> just keeping cool and then we walk inside into the air conditioning and 
the cold air comes into the sides, into the vents, and then the hot air just comes right off of the top of your head through the top of the hat. These are fantastic if you want to keep a little cooler and still keep your cool and do steampunk um, and really rock out a fashion statement. These are awesome. So those are on the website and in the um, album section at the top as well. Hubby and I both have several of those hats because we can, because I make them. So <laughs> that is uh, several, those are all available. So that is everything that is available on sale, uh, kind of one of each. Um, I have, oh, I have a big box back there. Oh, I don't think you can see it in the background. It's ready to go to Venice. I have all of the stuff. The paintings are in there. Um, I'm talking to the shipping company over the next couple of days. So I have three paintings going to Venice, Italy for the Contemporary Venice Art Show. And I am extremely excited about this. So I hope they do really well there. And I hope people fall in love with them. Uh, I will show you pictures of those um, once they get shipped and out the door. All right, so here we are at the monthly painting. This is our monthly painting, and the first week of the month, we poured the background. You gave me color suggestions, and I poured this beautiful tropical island. Second week, I gave you a choice of three end finial designs right here. And you chose this one, and if you can see, there's little fishies or little sharky sharkies swimming up to the island. And I did a brand new central design for my spiral on this painting, so this right now is a one of a kind. Um, this one is called Tropical Island, and that is the name you gave it last week. So if you're looking for a painting to remind you of your vacation, um, maybe it was on a tropical island, really beautifully uh, surrounded by a, a gorgeous blue sea, Have lovely long beaches, some little private beaches, little nooks and crannies you can get lost in there. Um, if you want a painting that will bring you peace, calm, and joy, and rem remind you of your vacation and your downtime, this is going to be a great little piece. If you want a painting that reminds you of sand between your toes, um, but this this will never actually put sand in your house from your suitcase. <laughs> so it's a lot easier to keep clean and clean up after this arrives. And if you want something uh, to remember your vacation by, this is a great little painting. It is uh, 12 by 16. So there's... Um, enough space on it that it will take up a bit of your wall space but there's not so much of it that it's going to um, take up the entire wall space this would also go great in like a sunroom or uh, like if you have a tropical themed uh, bathroom since I do paint in acrylic paints they are water resistant they will not repel water so I don't think you should hang this over the kid's bathtub because it will ruin the painting eventually. But if, if it accidentally gets splashed or it gets a little misty, it won't buckle, it won't warp. That's what acrylic is really best at. So if you want this piece, just say first dibs in the comments. It is $1,000 and that includes free shipping in the continental U.S. If you're outside the continental U.S. and you want this piece, we'll have to talk about shipping and customs. Okay, let me see what else is going on here. Got to check my notes. It's been a long day, so I want to make sure I get everything for you. I see Doe is with us. Hi, Doe. Uh, so I went over the clearance sale. I went over the items. I went over that thing that Venice. So just to remind you, the uh, Doe says, I love your art. Thank you, Doe. 
I am so thankful that you do love my art. I appreciate it very, very much. If you ever see a piece that you can't live without, just let me know. Um, so everything on the studio clearance sale is 50% off until this Friday at midnight. Friday at midnight, whatever your local time is, um, the sale is over. So I did sell a bunch of the little jewel paintings. So you'll see those sales popping up today, tomorrow, and Friday. So if you have your eye on one particularly that you need to call your own, um, do go ahead and let me know because I am uh, selling those like hotcakes, which is really fantastic. Other than that, if you would like to talk to me about um, maybe what kind of art would go best in your home, what size, what color, um, if I have anything that will go with your decor, I am absolutely happy to do that. We'll get on a free consultation call. Um, it's Zoom or FaceTime and we'll just sit and chat and figure out what you need. And I absolutely love doing that because when you tell me and show me kind of some of the colors in your room and kind of what you're going for. I have uh, images actually pop into my head. <laughs> and I sometimes have paintings that are already available. And if not, then we can do a commission if you are up for that. And I am available for commission calls or consultation calls and commission calls, just let me know over in Messenger. If you don't have Messenger, go ahead and um, just put a comment here in the comment section or go ahead and write me a little post and we will talk about it. We'll figure out a way to talk about it kind of behind the scenes so not everybody's in your business. And uh, next Wednesday, right here, 7 p.m. is another Zen Stay Wednesday Live. Oh, what are we doing next Wednesday? Let me look. Uh, next Wednesday, ooh, next Wednesday, we're pouring a painting for the next monthly painting for October. So that's going to be a lot of fun. I always enjoy painting for you guys. And I was going to do that tonight, but we have a thunderstorm coming through and I don't know if the power is going to go off or not. So I'm trying to keep this relatively short. So that is, speaking of which, that is going to be it for me. <laughs> for tonight. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your evening and a wonderful rest of your week, and I will see you next Wednesday. Bye, everyone.